In this video we're going to show how to perform a Travis adjustment in Trimble Axis. Now for that we're going to use a data set we collected in the field, starting from point drain 1, which is set for control coordinate. Now, uh, in order to be able to perform a Travis adjustment, all the stations need to have um, at least a foresight and a backside um, between them, with phase 1 observations. To access the Traverse function, we need to go into our Kogo menu, second page, Traverse. I'm going to name our Traverse, Traverse 1, and we need to start a station. I'm going to our list and select one. Now, I want to select the one I set for control, drain 1. Next. And you can start adding stations to the software. Now, when I add one, it gives us two options. That's depending on the direction you want to take, if it's a closed or open uh, traverse. Since I want to do a closed one for this example, I just select Drain 2. And then when I click Add, it will automatically search the database for valid stations to add, and it will just add them at once without asking for more details. Now, if I wanted to leave the traverse open, I would just stop here and close my traverse. But I want to do a closed one. So I'm going to add drain 1 again. And I'm going to check my options for adjustment. The method will be compass or voltage. And the error distribution will be proportional to distance in either angular and distances. We have usual options, proportional, equal, or none. I'm just going to leave this as it is. I could also change the adjustment method to, to transit, which I'm not going to do at this point, and I'm going to accept. And now close my traverse. I need to confirm my backside and four, four side points for my start station. I'm not going to change these. I could just go into the list and change for any other valid points. I'm going to leave it leave it as it, as it is. Enter. We have here a report on the misclosures of the traverse, which will then be applied when I adjust the angles of my traverse by clicking the Adjust Angles button and Adjust Distances. Adjust the coordinates have been stored. If we revert back to our map, we can see the symbol has changed and now we have Adjust Coordinates for all the points in our traverse. The first one, since it has been set to control, it remains fixed with the same coordinates. And that's it.